girls and boys, this is Queen Brooks from Art in the House. Your Miss Q to you artist. And today we're going to share, I'm going to share with you a little project called BFA Wall Hanging. Best friends always. Okay, so here are the supplies that I'm using. First of all, you see I'm using these sticks. And these sticks are larger than the sticks that you normally see in the arts and crafts department. I got them at the hardware store. And they come 30 in a pack. They're less than a dollar. And this is what the package looks like. This is what it looks like on the package. Okay. And we're going to make this wall hanging out of these sticks. We can use markers. We can use twine. We have to use some Gorilla Glue. We can use paint. We need scissors. We need a glue gun and glue sticks. And I think that's, oh yes, and these are recycled uh, pull tips or from the cans that you can use to help hang your wall hanging. So. I've done a lot of the work because it takes a little bit of time. This is for my older kids, so it'll take you a little bit of time. But I'm going to show you what I did. So I put all these sticks together side by side. Right here you see that. I put them together like that. Okay. And I didn't stick them together on the edges what I did. I took the tape. Maybe you can see it. I don't know. There's two pieces. Whoa. But you can use three pieces. You can fill it up if you need to. So I'm going to use another piece. If I can find out where it begins and ends. Yeah, here we go. Yay. So, so. We're going to start this in. So I'm going to have to cut it. It's sticky. And we're just going to put it down like that. And it's going to hold all of these sticks together. Okay. And I'm going to cut it right here. And I fold mine on the edge so I know where it's at. Okay, so now you know how to put them together. Then, we'll take some additional sticks and we'll glue them to this last board. And that's what I'm going to do with the glue gun. Oh, please be careful if you're using a glue gun. You do not want to get burnt. You do not want to feel the heat of the glue. Okay. And you will fill it through these boards. I tell you. Trust me. So we're going to glue that. Now if there's a space in the middle. It doesn't matter. Because what I'm suggesting is that you find something. That you can glue. That will cover that space in the middle. And it will look so cool on the other side. I don't have one. I don't have anything right now to do that. So that's how your piece will look. And if glue comes through, just take something and scrape it off as soon as you can using my scissors. There you go. See how quick that was. I found a piece of wood and I put it here. You can, if you find some wood, it'd be great to put it on here. You can put it anywhere you want to. In fact, you can put something else on here if you like, like a piece of, of a cardboard. I'm not going to do that. I don't feel like cardboard on here today. But you can do it. So, then you want to put your hangers on. So, I have a hanger on here. And I'm going to put one on the other side. And, and then I'm going to glue it down. And you have to be patient. 
You have to put a lot of glue on it, put it on the hanger, like I'm doing. And of course you got your stringy strings. And then you put it on your piece, like that. And we're going to push it down. It's on there really good. Make sure that glue covers it. It doesn't matter if it's messy. In the back. So there's some glue that fell on there. And I will wait till it dries because it's still hot. So you're going to do that. And then you're going to tie this to the other uh, hanger. But you don't want to do it right now, but you'll tie it to the other hanger. And I'm putting this here because I don't want this glue to dry on my table. I'm hoping it don't dry on the... Okay. Ouch. Well, it was wet and it was hot. Okay. So, what you can do is you can write your best friend's names. And I'll put L I C A. That's one of my best friends. And then you can do, do different colors. And then you can paint one of them like this. But take your time. Take your time. And then you can do another uh, name and paint again taking your time I don't have a lot of time to spend doing this so I'm kind of rushing when you rush to do something it never turns out quite like you like it to okay Okay, so you can let that dry and put another color on it. I mean, another coat. Or you can put another color if you want to. Okay. So, there you go. We can put some more name, another name here and another color. Or however you like to do it. You can paint this and paint all of it. Okay. So, that's about it for now. I'm glad you were able to come and visit with me. So, go out and have fun with art. Talk to you later. Bye.